Manchester United suspend Mason Greenwood following assault claim. The football club says Greenwood will not return to training or play matches until further notice. Manchester United have acted quickly to nip things in the bud as far as their striker Mason Greenwood is concerned. Earlier on Sunday, distressing audio was released by Greenwood's reported girlfriend, Harriet Robson, which purported to indicate she was being subjected to an alleged rape by the Red Devil striker. Images of injuries, allegedly inflicted by Greenwood, were also released by her. In response to that, Manchester United released a statement which read, via James Ducker, We are aware of images and allegations circulating on social media. We will not make any further comments until the facts have been established. Manchester United does not condone violence of any kind. That was followed by another from Greater Manchester Police, via the Daily Mail's Mike Keegan. Greater Manchester Police is aware of images and videos circulating on social media. Inquiries are ongoing to establish the full circumstances. As well as a third from Nike, the player's boot sponsor, via The Athletic, we are deeply concerned by the disturbing allegations and will continue to closely monitor the situation. Caught Offside also reported on how four United First Team stars swiftly unfollowed the youngster on social media. By mid-afternoon, United released a further statement which will have been damning for Greenwood. Mason Greenwood will not return to training or play matches until further notice, it read, cited by ESPN's Rob Dawson, effectively suspending him from all football-related activities. If the allegations made are proven, then there seems to be no way back for the player in terms of a footballing career. A clearly gifted footballer, Greenwood had already made some poor choices in the past. Taking girls back to his hotel room whilst away with England right in the middle of the COVID pandemic. The latest furore surrounding the 20-year-old has clearly shocked many, though it must be remembered that in England, everyone is innocent until proven guilty. The player will surely be holding on to what little hope he has of being able to put the situation to one side and move on with his career, however, the police will now have to pore over the evidence presented to determine if a crime has been committed.